Yes, Aunt Annie. I heard laughter. Yes. I was dreaming. I must have talked in my sleep. Another nightmare. Yes. A magnificent nightmare. Go to bed, Aunt Annie. Everything's fine. I think I'll write for a while. How arrogant of us, creatures of the moment, whose very species is but an experiment in Deus Naturae, to arrogate to ourselves an immortal future and considerable status. How do we know that that form of atomic and molecular motion called life is the highest of all forms? Perhaps the dominant creature, the most rational and godlike of all beings, is an invisible gas? Personally, I should not care for immortality in the least. There is nothing better than oblivion, since in oblivion there is no wish unfulfilled. We had it before we were born, yet did not complain. Shall we then whine because we know it will return? The mammals, of which man is part, are simply a psychochemical phenomenon, a component of carbon animated by a form of electric energy. This energy disappears and the body disintegrates. Everything is finished. 